After years of being a financial advisor to adults, Susan Beecham discovered that her advice might have greater benefits for young children. Well, th this is the most extraordinary time to reach and teach them about money. Why? Because, you know, in first grade, we're geniuses. And they love us. So she started a new career teaching young children simple lessons about managing money, but she needed a way to make the message tangible for her young audience. I originally started with four cups that I would hole punch and twist tie together and label. So I went to sleep one night and I had a dream. And I actually dreamt of the Money Savvy Pig. It has one ear up and one ear down, and it had four tummies. Save, spend, donate, and invest. And the money came out of each tummy. And I went, that's it. That's the piggy bank for the 21st century. With this simple and user-friendly teaching aid, her company began reaching many more children. Seven years ago, we started with one child, reaching one child at a time. And today, we're in over 500 schools, we're in 27 states, and we've shipped the Money Savvy Pig to the world. Teachers enjoy how the program utilizes many activities, not just the piggy bank, in a highly structured series of lessons. I can't tell you how many times kids surprise me at what they understand and what kids say and how they connect it to their real life. And that's one of the things that Money Savvy really, really does for kids. It connects to real life. Along the way, the couple fearlessly tackled issues such as offshore manufacturing and product fulfillment. The original development of the bank was about 11 months from concept to saleable units. There you go. We've just received our first shipment of a new product. It's the Money Savvy Football, and we believe that it will be appealing to older kids. You know how you spend your whole life feeling that we were really put here to do something special? Well, I got lucky because I found out in my early 40s what the something special was. And it was reaching and teaching kids about the choices that they have for money. Because what we're trying to do is to create a generation that knows how to control impulses and delay gratification. We do that, and I'll know that we've made a contribution.